It's time for some vlogs. It's time for some vlogs. Hey guys, so it's Steven here, and this is the thing. Uh, akong i break ang akong keto with. I, I, I don't know if I'll be able to break my keto, but I'm gonna break my discipline for today. Sorry, ang hayag mo nas taas. So I'm with my I'm with Guada and we're here in the Abaca Koan sorry. Abaca nga company nga bagong open there is Rustans. So si Guada nangihi lang si Guada sa silo ng CR. But here it is. Wow. Okay. Wow. Nice touch. Okay, ha. As always, the order of coffee. This is a uh, cafe americano, but this time the whipping cream they placed in this fancy container. I hope this is enough, no? And then the thing that I want to uh, eat para ma break akong f uh, discipline is this. More of dark chocolate than siya. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna put na lang later in the editing on Sanisha. Basta it is uh, one of their koan, things na makao na to. Dali. Sige lang mag, mag b roll kung later sa ilang mga pagkaan ha. So kanya ko naman day hazelnut. Pero katong hazelnut is um, uh, sweeter. This is like uh, black chocolate or dark chocolate. And then Guada ordered this one. It's a uh, chocolate cake. There she is. That's all. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm gonna break my fast. Ah, uh, my discipline.
guys, what are my thoughts on what are my thoughts on the Quran? On going back to eating, it was like a, a puff pastry uh, with chocolate, dark chocolate, and uh, impressions uh, after four months of not eating bread, and now I ate bread. So sorry, ha, nasig pa sa sa Quran. Okay, akong feeling, uh, impression ako kay, pag-count na ako kay, to be honest, yan na ay murag, ang tamurag, wow, this is familiar, this feeling is familiar to bite on bread. Kanya, kwan mag yun, pastry, pag yun siya, no? So, kanya, when I tasted the chocolate, although dark chocolate chapter, tamis ka pa siya, karon karon nga na human ako, I really, I, I did finish everything, you know, I finished everything. That one whole piece of I know I'm not even counting anymore. Pila to card, whatever. But okay, I'm just here on a mission to break my discipline in keto. Karon ni kafil ko sa katamis on my throat. You know the feeling like you're about to have a sore throat or tonsillitis. Kana siya nga feeling. And tonsillitis has always been my my sickness for for many years na but. Karon, I feel it. I feel it again. I think I need a lot of water. So, more than sensitive na ko when it comes to sweets. Okay, so kanao sa paman. Also, try this. I'll try it. Guada is asking me to try this. This is chocolate. Their chocolate, sa mesa, chocolate, fudge, whatever. Okay. Yeah, they can go now. It's okay. Uh, first and first and foremost, when you are on keto, you only do this. You only break your keto discipline if you've been on keto like strictly. The key word is strictly on keto for three to four months. At least that's what I did. Um. I really can say that I have already, after four months of being on keto, like strictly on keto, uh, I've been able to create the habit and the discipline and I can actually tell myself now that it's enough. I know my limits now. I know as a kutub. So, muna siya. If you're just in, on keto, maybe transition pa two weeks, pa one month, pa especially kana mga earlier, I, I tell you, mo mo de ako ninyo guys because uh, what I'm trying to say is you can actually you can you, you you don't have to say goodbye forever to all the amazing stuff you, you see uh, in, in in bakeries like this. No, so kana uh, lang na just make sure that's what we call the health reserve. Just make sure that you've been 100 percent into the diet for like 100 percent, like really be and strict about it. And then after four months, like what I did, because four months ang wakapin karon, ni start na ko karon karon lang. So ang plano ani, so kato siya, do this after many months of being on keto. Number two, after this, I don't really know the I don't really know the content of the carbs. It might take me three days. It might take me one week to go back to keto again, or it may take me two days. No, depende lang sa kung kanon sunod. So later, ako kanon kay high fat yah, kon same keto, same keto. So moto siya nga critical po dahil Dr. Eric Burke said nga kung mukaon ka ug carbs, ug sugar, don't pair it with protein on one sitting. For example, ni kaon ko karon ug carbs, wala ko yung kaon ng meat, wala ko yung kaon ng fat. So dili ni mo isagol. So kung sa lang imong gi, imong gi kaon ng sugar lang, sugar lang yun. Or, or carbs. Kaniha again context ani after many months of being on keto. Next, um, don't do this every single time. Kai, ang imong body anad naman sa fat, fat adapted naman siya after four months, six months. So what you do is just no kanang kung basa makaingon na yung kanga kaya na nimo ang imong limit. You will know your limits. You know when to stop. 
So, I hope this helps you guys. This helps you in your. And I hope this is giving you a ray of hope. Na okay, delete delete na day ko mo say no to the sweets forever. So you can actually go back and then go back to keto again. You know the drill. You know what to eat naman de ba after four months. Again, don't do this one month, especially weeks since the keto ka ayon ng buhata. Do this after four six months. Then maka you will actually tell it sa mga kagalingon na bitaw na anat nako. Okay, so I hope this helps. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to Stephen Elias. I do vlogs like this. And I share with you my my life, and also comment, like, subscribe. Okay, comment, like, subscribe, and check out my other videos about keto. Remember, stay keto Filipino.